With the entire country facing tough times, an initiative in Wilmington has set out to not only help local businesses, but our health care providers and first responders as well. WWAY's Tanner Barth shows us how the idea was an instant hit. All the money will be spent at local restaurants that need the revenue now, and it will, all the meals or gift cards will be given to health care workers and first responders. The Greater Wilmington Business Journal, with help from tons of local organizations, set up a GoFundMe page on Monday trying to raise money to buy meals or gift cards from Wilmington area restaurants to give them to health care providers and first responders. Their original goal was $9,000. Less than 48 hours later, they have raised nearly $17,000. We had our first discussion on this Saturday. We had a conference call Sunday. We launched it Monday, and by Tuesday, we already had exceeded our $9,000 goal. They had planned to spend $300 per day on meals for health care professionals and first responders, but as the money raised continues to rise, it has the group thinking this may only be the beginning to a bigger and better boost to the Cape Fear community when they need it most. I would love to be in that predicament. That would be amazing. And I don't see why we wouldn't keep this going as much as we can if it's multiple deliveries a day or if it's keeping it going past April. I think taking care of the community would be a um, wonderful opportunity and our number one priority. Reporting from Wilmington, Tanner Barth, WWAY News. Perfect definition of win-win. And as of last count, they have now broken the $17,000 mark. You can visit our website, www.ytv3.com, to find out how to donate or to nominate a deserving health care candidate.